Uh, meanwhile, the defense team for one of Hillary Clinton's former campaign lawyers beginning its case today in court. Michael Sussman accused of lying to the FBI during an investigation into former President Trump's alleged ties to Russia. The former president was cleared of any wrongdoing. Nick Smith is following this case. He has more on whether Sussman may testify. Yeah, Adrian, it depends. If the judge in the case honors a defense request to bar prosecutors from asking Sussman certain questions, his lawyers say he'll take the stand. That's a decision that could be hours away. Michael Sussman is the first person to go to trial under an investigation led by special prosecutor John Durham who is investigating an alleged conspiracy to tank former President Donald Trump's 2016 presidential run. The charge? A single count of lying to the FBI about his ties to the Clinton campaign. Prosecutors say that lie sparked an FBI investigation into the Trump organization. During the 2016 campaign, Sussman told the FBI he had information on secret communications between Trump's company and a Russian bank. That allegation has since been debunked. One former FBI official told News Nation earlier this week he's troubled by Sussman's level of access. He used his connections to James Baker to come into the building, uh, to make those assertions. It was a little bit too easy for him to do that in my mind. But the legal issue is whether the meeting happened under false pretenses. The prosecution presented a text Sussman sent to Baker hours beforehand that read, I'm coming on my own not on behalf of a client or company. Prosecutors say Sussman was really there on behalf of Hillary Clinton's presidential campaign, which he billed for the meeting. They argue had the FBI known, the Russia probe may not have happened. Sussman's lawyers are expected to argue he didn't lie during the meeting itself and that the FBI knew about his connections to the Democratic Party. They also claim there's no evidence the FBI investigated Trump based solely on Sussman's information. A conviction on a single charge of lying to the FBI could land Sussman in prison for up to five years. But the American taxpayers are also paying a price. The investigation into Russia has lasted more than three years at a reported cost of nearly $4 million. Adrian. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.